In this VSIM tutorial, we're going to talk about making links and drawing roads and connecting links or roads. In VSIM, a link is a representation and another name for a roadway. Before placing the link, you want to zoom in on your target area where you're going to be construct constructing the roadway. This just shows for a better view of what you're doing and where you're going to place your links. To place a link, you go up into your network editor shown on the left side and you're going to make sure that links is selected and highlighted in orange here. And then we're going to draw our first link. Hold down the alt button, right click, and drag the link to where you want it to go. And then once to finish building the link, you want to just let up on both the alt key and the right click. And then you'll see that this box will come up and this is going to be all the information that is about this link. So we're going to make this link as realistic to the roadway as we can. Um, as you see in this roadway right here, there's three lanes. There's the left turn bay There's and there's two through lanes. Um, so we're, we need three lanes and you'll see that right here. You will change this to number of lanes to three. You can give your street name street a name let's just call it street one and then you see it when you added in the number of lanes it comes up with the three lanes and each width um, typically for a left turn bay it is smaller so we can change this width to say 10 feet and then the rest will leave at 12 feet so as you can see when you have your link placed you see those arrows that marks the direction and flow of traffic so say my link i wanted it actually in this lane to reverse the tra flow of traffic you right click on your link and then you'll go down to reverse direction and that will change the direction that your arrows are pointing in so we can just keep this here because this has two lanes for straight through and one turning for your left turn bay. So now let's go ahead and try and connect these links to another link. To do that you're going to create another link, hold down alt, right click, and drag across. And this link needs to have, and this link needs to have two lanes. And we'll call this Okay, starting over. So now we're going to connect the links, and to do that, we need to obviously build another roadway to connect it to. So we're going to go, let's build one right here for straight through traffic, and there's two lanes. So we'll hold down the Alt and the right click at the same time, drag the roadway, and this lane has two, and we'll call this street number two, one in the west direction okay. and we'll verify that the flow of traffic is going the correct way and it is on both links and then to connect the links you're going to draw a connector and make sure that you're still up here in the links mode okay so to connect these two links you will Start by holding down, making sure the first link is selected. You're going to hold down the right click and control, and then you'll see that that build that right there, and then those two connect. And then you're going to pop up with the lanes that are connecting. So, say I in this situation the lanes connected in the right position, but say it was these two lanes connected it would show this would be incorrect. So we want to make sure that those two lanes are connected, two and three and one and two, to make sure that these the traffic is flowing through on these two lanes while the third lane is turning right. So this was just for connecting two straight roads. So now let's try and take it up a level and connect it to a curve. So we're going to do the same thing. We're going to hold down right click and alt 
and we're going to create the link. This roadway has two lanes and we'll give it North Street as a name. And now we're going to want to connect this and we're going to hold down control and right. We're going to make sure that this link's selected, hold down control, right click and connect those two. So for this, this is obviously going to be traffic is turning right. So we're going to select the desired direction is right. And we'll leave that like that. And okay. Okay, so now that we have those two links connected um, for the right turn, we we're saying because there's two lanes right here that this far lane can turn right and this middle lane can also turn right. But it obviously does not look like how a car would move because it's straight. So to edit this, you're going to click on the link, the connector, and you're going to right click and you're going to cl click generate spline. So the spline, it gives the roadway a curve. So say we want it to be at five. And now you can see that the link and the connector is arced rather than straight. And we can play with that again and show that this just makes it more curved, but there's only so much curve that you can get between two links. 